Hi everybody, it's Adam with ArtValveSurgery.com and I'm thrilled to be here with Dr. Anyawu from the Mount Sinai Medical Center in New York, New York. He's a cardiac surgeon there and Dr. Anyawu, thanks for being with us. I know you've uh, performed surgery on many patients out there including Bob DeVos, so thanks for your help with that. Okay. And I've got a question, what type of cardiac surgery do you specialize in at Mount Sinai? And I specialize in three, three main things. The first is uh, co my complex mitral valve repair, mm -hmm. and the second is heart valve reoperations. Mm -hmm. So reoperators are patients who have had surgery and need another operation for the valve. And the third is uh, ventricular assist devices and heart transplantation. So those are the broad areas I specialize in. Yeah, and it's specific to your seems like your second specialty is which is the reoperations. I know a lot of patients out there. Um, they don't think that far ahead in the process. Most people are first time valve surgery patients and I guess a big question for them is, is that common? It, it is relatively common and it's common for the reason that valve surgery is now very widely practiced and very successful. So if you look at the common types of valve surgery which are valve repair and valve replacement, for every 100, 100 patients who have valve repair, something like one or two a year will need another a re -operation. It could happen a year after surgery, it could happen 10 years after, 20 years after, but every year there's a subset of patients that need operations. If you have a valve replacement with an animal valve, mm -hmm. most young patients will need a reoperation in their lifetime because at some point, usually somewhere around 10 to 15 years after surgery, the valve will break, break down and start leaking. If you have a mechanical valve, a metal valve, there's also some reoperations because of clots on the valve or, or uh, infections. And the other issue with mitral valve repair, because more and more surgeons are doing mitral valve repair, the level of skill and expertise is very variable. So as, as surgeons climb through their learning curve, a lot of these valve repairs will fail. Mm. And then as you get better at it, you have fewer failures. So the growing area which we specialize in is having to re-repair valves. So valves where a surgeon has done a repair, the repair has failed either months or years later, and then we repair it a second time. So it's a real growing cohort of patients that need re-operations. Got it. And in the re-operation process, I'm curious to know, is that a more complex procedure than a first-time valve surgery? Yes, it, it is more complicated because there are essentially two operations within a re-operation. The first is just getting back into the chest is an operation in itself for the surgeon because each time your body is cut it heals by scarring so in the same way you have a scar on your skin if you have surgery mm -hmm. the whole inside of your chest is a big scar yeah. so getting back in safely through the scar without injuring the heart or injuring any of the blood vessels or bypass grafts if the patient has any bypass grafts it's a, lot, it's a big operation and it requires a lot of planning mm -hmm. and, uh, and thought and different techniques to get in safely and once that's been accomplished, reoperating on the valve itself is, a, is itself another operation. Got it. And I'm thinking, when I hear complex, and I think of the team that's needed to do this, yeah. I imagine that you, you have your team, but do you ever have a situation where you're with another surgeon doing one of these complex reoperations? Oh, certainly. The bulk of the complex valve work we do, mm -hmm. we have two surgeons on the team. Mm -hmm. and, and the way we look at it is that two pairs of eyes are better than one, mm -hmm. two pairs of hands are better than one. And it's like if you're flying, you know, a small turboprop plane with a single prop, you can fly with one pilot. Mm -hmm. But if you're flying a 747 across the Pacific, you have two or three pilots. Mm -hmm. And I think it's the same analogy. We, we feel it needs a lot of thought. There's a lot of decision making and also a lot of technical surgery to be done. So. A lot of these surgeries, we have two surgeons, two experienced valve surgeons mm -hmm. working on the same patient. Got it. Well, uh, Dr. Yanwu, thank you so much for sharing your expertise today with us and all the good work you're actually doing out there in your clinic. We really appreciate it. And thanks for your ongoing pursuit of, of healthy hearts. Thanks okay. for stopping by today. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Thank you.